Hello guys, so I'm back again with another quick video on the Verizon Note 3 series. Now this video can be used uh, with other Android devices. It's going to be a quick little video showing you how to back up your apps before you install a fresh ROM or if you're wanting to make any changes to your phone and you currently have a setup that you like or you have a set of applications that you don't want to lose. I'm going to show you how to keep those applications uh, backed up so then you can restore them after you're done doing whatever modification you're doing to your phone so this is gonna be a nice quick easy tutorial that will lead into my next video which is how to install ROMs on your Verizon Note 3 using SafeStrap so without further ado let's get started first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here to the computer and we're going to download titanium backup onto your phone now I have the Pro um, because that allows you, and you can read up here on the Read More, uh, what you could do with a Pro. Uh, you can back up, restore uh, your SMS, your MMS. We're doing applications, uh, so you can back up, restore, and freeze with Pro your apps, your data, and market links. So this includes all your protected apps and system apps. Uh, what we're, uh, what I'm going to be showing you is how to do your system apps how to just do your apps themselves because sometimes when you back up that data it will sometimes mess with the ROM or application or some modification you're doing to your phone it can mess with that so I'm just gonna show you how to back up your applications so go ahead and uh, download titanium backup and buy the pro edition so the pro edition isn't much I forget how much it is I think it was like uh, four dollars or so so it's not much um, and it does help you out a lot on uh, time if you're going to be modifying your phone a lot or if you're going to be testing out various ROMs and you want to have those same applications backed up all the time it's going to save you a lot of time and headache uh, and then it also has a, a whole bunch of other cool features that I will be making videos on the, in the future some features like uh, freezing applications you don't want uh, even uninstalling applications that your system itself does not allow which is kinda risky but sometimes there are some applications that you don't want uh, go ahead and get this installed and we will progress on the phone okay so here we are in titanium backup I've already installed it and everything I'm gonna go ahead and grant it super user access okay so as you can see I have root access everything's already set up I have the, the backup directory I have it set up uh, to my external SD card uh, in a folder called titanium backup so all we have to do is hit your menu key on your phone and then go to batch actions under general and then underneath the backup we're gonna back up all user apps now here are your other options you have backup all system data and backup all user apps plus system data but these two options right here could cause issues if you're installing a new ROM fresh or whatever modifications you might be doing it might cause issues so all that we care about right now is our user apps so we're gonna run backup all user apps then you can choose all your apps that you have so it will automatically pause them and back them up so go ahead and select the applications you want to keep and back up so you can restore them later on okay so I've went ahead and selected all the applications I want to back up another thing I was thinking about while I was doing this is make sure that all of your contacts and all of your other information is backed up so what I personally do is I just keep my contacts and everything synced up with Google so that's already done so make sure everything else is backed up uh, so okay so I'm gonna do the check mark right here and it will automatically start backing up all my applications. I'm gonna let this run and I'll be right back whenever it's completed. Okay, so it is just about done and it is completed. So that's it for your backing up. So next thing you're gonna wanna do is do whatever modification you're gonna do. Everything's already backed up. And for me, it's on that titanium backup folder in my external SD card so that's it that's all it takes for you to back up and just to quickly show you I'm not gonna go ahead and do it yet uh, you can see in my next video how I restore all my applications and how it looks after I've installed my ROM uh, but just go to batch actions under general in the menu 
it's going to calculate the scenarios and then just scroll down to restore and you can re restore all your apps with data all right so that's it for backing up your applications uh, my next video is going to go more in depth in how to restore those applications so they will automatically install all your data that's in your application should be there so to see all that in action make sure to subscribe so you can see the new video that I'm gonna come out with showing you how to install a fresh ROM with a safe strap onto your phone and you can install multiple ROMs so I'll go more in depth in that in that next video so if you'd like to see all that coming up soon be sure to subscribe to my channel you'll get those videos as soon as they come out and also if you found this video informative be sure to like it so more people can check this out if you have any questions any comments uh, on this video or on any of my videos in this Verizon Note 3 series be sure to leave a comment down below that way I can get better at helping you guys and help myself improve so that's it for now y'all have a good one